All right, lads. Pretty sure this is going to be a first. I'm like. 100% sure this is going to be a first. It's a My College Life episode without me going to college. Before you say, Sean, what is the point of that? This is the series. This is what we're rolling with. So My College Life is the week. You know, so it makes sense to me to keep the My College Life theme going through it because, you know, it's still a week. I'm still in college. I'm just not in college today. The plan for today is, been up since early in the morning. I just filmed the Q&A with Gav last night. Stayed up until 3 o'clock in the morning editing that and then got up at 9 to finish editing it. Just finished editing it. Just finished editing it there. My mom's in there ironing and stuff, talking to her. I think we're gonna go do some shopping a little bit, like food shopping and stuff. Then I'm gonna hit the gym with Dano full day, take you through my pull workout. It'll be a good day, a few little things going on. And then, of course, recently clicked on the video. Roll the clip from last night. Alright lads, so I just got in the door from the gym right there, so excuse the state of my head, but exciting news. Just got two packages, came home, there's two big packages sitting here waiting for me. I think I know what this is. I think this is the big one. So, uh, this is what I came home to. One package. Two package. Two package? Does that even make sense? No. I'm about to crack these open. Let's see what we got. Hey, yeah! Okay, I'm just gonna throw everything out. I'm not even gonna look at it real quick. I'm just gonna throw everything out. Oh shit, okay, this is a lot. Oh my god, okay. One empty package, let's see. Okay, 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 okay. All right, so. Cat is out of the bag, that's the one. This is the one I've been waiting to announce for so long, since July. I signed the contract back in July with Physique. I'm sponsored by Physique Apparel, full sponsorship. I'm gonna have a look through all these clothes now, hopefully everything fits me. I'm gonna see what it's like, yeah, I'll keep you updated in a minute. So yeah, we're gonna have to talk about that in serious detail later. But for now, I'm gonna grab some breakfast, grab some food, and get out with my day. Let's go. The most highly requested video of the last day was a how to bulk video, so like a student bulking video. So I'm not actually gonna film that today purely because of the fact that I'm not in college and I wanna make it really centered around how to eat in college and stuff. But right now, I'm about to grab my breakfast. Same breakfast as I always eat, guys. I'll show you that now. So I'm on my way to the gym. We just have to make a quick little pit stop at Leafy Valley. Go get my mom some medicine. She's essentially broken her back. I mean, I'm not being dramatic or anything, but her back is broken. Yeah, I'm just gonna go in, grab her some Nurofen, get her back on the road to recovery, because I mean, the only way to cure things is to just completely dose yourself up with medicine. I don't recommend that, I'm kidding. Also, this is just a nice way of me telling my mom that I think she smells bad. Yeah, you're welcome, mom. You got the goods. Hey, mom. You got you some shower gel because you smell bad. Stop. heavy squats tomorrow so we go slightly lighter on the deadlift today and then on the Friday we go do heavy deadlifts heavy back day so got 120 on the bar I'm gonna try and do this for three or four sets of eight see how it goes and then we'll take it from there let's go Next up, T-bar row, chest supported T-bar row. I see so many people in the gym that's just doing this exercise, like so badly. Just free from the weight up. It's a, it's not a compound movement if your chest is supported. So don't treat it like a compound movement. You try to lift a ton of weight. Slow and control, bring it up, squeeze. I'm gonna show you now. Now, 
Nano and I are having a, be a debate about this at the minute. At the minute, I feel like if you come in closer and pull all the way through and stop the range of motion here, with the tension still on your lats, it's a better stretch and squeeze. He's saying some bullshit about standing further away, and I was just wrong. So don't it's listen to him. Uh, it's bad. This is the way I'm doing it. I want you to watch my back, because it should look engaged the entire way through the movement. Okay, maybe not because I'm a little bit flabby right now, but if I was really lean, you'd be able to see it working all the way through, right? Not stupidly wide, not stupidly close, kind of a neutral grip just outside shoulder width. Eight to ten reps, depending on how I'm feeling. Nothing heavy, again, pulling it down, full contraction, squeeze all the way up, all the way down, squeeze it all the way. Mind muscle connection is probably the most important thing you can do with back training. The thing most people miss out on the most is that mind muscle connection and actually engaging their lats throughout the movement. So. Last exercise, we're back. Seated table row. You know the drill, people, you know what I'm gonna say. So controlled, I'm squeezing. I come all the way through, all the way all the way back now, full stretch on the lap. Actually, you're gonna see it now, actually. something I never mentioned. The grip is very important on how you do back exercises. If you're gripping something with your thumb locked around it as well, you're going to pull through your bicep. Whereas if you take your thumb out in a motion and engage kind of a hook grip, something like this, or just even like this, it's all going to come through your back. Because once you engage your wrist like that, you're pulling through your uh, biceps. So, let's go. any of the arms workout because I'm just too standard anyway everybody knows how to train arms my arms aren't even good enough for me to be giving you advice it's bicep training by the way not like triceps but uh yeah you'll probably see it on Friday some training with a special guest on Friday so you'll see it then all right let's so I'm home been home for a couple of hours but I just wanted to have a little sit down talk kind of close out the video right. obviously the last couple of videos there's been like a couple of sponsorship announcements there's been a lot of things happening you know with regards to all of this you know I got my first sponsorship back in July. Yeah, July. And obviously I've got a few of them since then. And what I don't want to happen is for it to seem like I'm kind of like throwing all these sponsorships in your faces and being like, look how great I am, I have these sponsorships. Because that's not how I feel about it and that's not how I want you to think I feel about it. So I'm extremely happy to be in the position I'm in right now. You know, life, life for me is going really, really well at the minute. Like there's so many exciting opportunities and exciting times coming my way at the minute and it's all because of like this this thing that i do and the interaction that i have with the people who watch me or follow me on instagram or whatever that's cool like the fact that this is now genuinely for me anyway in college as a college student a tangible business now is insane i 
when I started this lads I had no idea that it could go this far obviously I saw like the success of the people at the top of the game blah 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 but I didn't think for a minute that that would be me making a living from doing this you know from wearing certain clothes from drinking a certain protein you know stuff like that from wearing a certain watch I didn't think that'd be me but now it is and I don't want to like lie to you and tell you oh I'm just wearing this clothes because of this you know I'm always going to be 100% transparent with you guys because I'm not ever going to come on here and be fake or anything and be like oh no I'm not getting paid to promote this or I'm not you know I'll always if I'm getting paid to promote something you're going to know if I'm sponsored by somebody you're going to know there's not going to be any like underhand sly advertising or anything like that my thoughts on physique I'm so happy to finally be able to tell you that it was physique I've known this since mid-July I've been signed with them since mid-July and for one reason or another things just kept getting in the way and we haven't gotten around to getting clothes out until now but uh, it's here. I love the stuff. I love the quality of everything. I'm very happy. Like, I've, I'm a fully sponsored athlete now, like, which is pretty cool. 21 years of age. Yeah, man. I mean, life is just good right now. I'm very happy. But I also, as I said, don't want it to seem like I'm just throwing all these sponsorships out, you know, like I'm selling out or whatever. Like, you know, I'm not. It's, they're all sensible sponsorships and they're all things that have discount codes for you guys as well. So, like, everything that I am sponsored by, I have a discount code for. All the discounts for everything are down in the description of this video. That's that, I guess. That's everything I wanted to say. So if you enjoyed the video, people, make sure to leave it a like, subscribe if you're new, and I will see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching. Peace.